and I stress for your own safety, do not walk home alone. She was just walking home. Women have been trying to reclaim the streets in the UK since the 1970s. The man has been arrested in connection with the Yorkshire Ripper murder. Clearly, it hasn't worked. So what now? This is not about women. All day, the strap that the viewers can see beneath us right now has been saying women's safety concerns. And that immediately frames the entire debate as if it's your problem as a woman. Women are the victims. This is about men. More than one third of all women in the world will experience physical or sexual violence. This is almost a billion women around the world. You know, they're hookers, so it's fine. Don't worry about me, mate. I'm up to my neck in flux at the moment. You see this content over and over and over again, and this normalizes the violence. I tried attacking two women. Did not work. And the only reason to wait a month for sex is if the girl is 17 years, 11 months old. Stalking is a very loaded term. I prefer to think of it as extreme like it. I wanna walk through the park in the dark, man. I'm scared that women will laugh at them. I wanna walk through the park in the dark, women. I'm scared that men will kill them. Robin Thicke's Blurred Lines is the most downloaded song of all time in the UK. The violence becomes a meme, but it's just a joke. Right, right, right. The evil that men do lives on and on. Tell him what it's like to be a woman. Tell him that we have to be on guard every time we walk down the street at night, walk through a park, get into a cab, take a train, go out drinking, walk to our car, go on a date, be in a lift with a stranger. Every single day. There is a constant threat to our safety from men. Calling, wolf whistling. He punched me in the face. Touching us in ways we don't want them to. He tells me that he's got to kill me. Strangers following us home from the tube late at night. I was in the road and the man said, you need a fuck. Anna Oskio Clover, Tina Eyre, Katie Simpson, Ben Bird, and her two year old daughter, Samantha Heap, Gita Goyal, Imogen Goyal Stuck, Beijing Zhu. There has been much debate over what I would say at the end of the list. Her name rings out across all of our media. We have all prayed that the name of Sarah Everett would never be on any list. Let's pray every day and work every day to make sure nobody's name ends up on this list again. The Skewer was an unusual production for BBC Radio 4 and BBC Sounds. Dead women is a thing we've all just accepted as part of our daily lives. Dead women is just one of those things.